Oh, what was that? Uh, oh wow, I think I discovered a new glitch. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Level Tours. We are here in Bomb Week. Very exciting. And we're doing uh, bombs at Lakeside. There's a uh, first bomb we're going to come across right there. And uh, of course, simple one right there. Two really cheap bombs. Uh, you can also, uh, let's see, are they, so it looks like my team is losing by quite a lot, so I probably, well, anyway, uh, let's see, so up here we are alone, we've got a box, uh, we'll take a look real quick, hopefully get a bomb out of this, and yeah, maybe not, okay, so we'll just keep going, they're going to be spawning behind me, so I should probably get hustling. Uh, oh, yep. Okay, just barely got away there. Uh, so, um, a lot of good bombs uh, on Lakeside. You might be thinking, you know, Lakeside's a sniper's map. Why would I be talking about bombs? Um, but there are probably 20 or 30 good bomb positions on Lakeside. Like right here at the top of the ladder. Basically mandatory if you're sniping up here. Um, or here, like outside this wall uh, or window, I guess. Um, geez, I don't know, dozens, dozens of places to leave bombs on like that. So, uh, let's see if we can actually make any useful ones. Let's see. So here on this, on this corner is probably the best one to put, um, on that couch, on this couch or chair rather, uh, even like, I don't know. I'm, I'm currently just being a loud distraction for my team. Um, right here is probably the best spot, like right there behind there. Um. Oh, here's some bad guys. Now my bait has proven useful. Hey. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, okay. And... Oh no, it wouldn't... Oh! <laughs> Alright, well, I think I pretty much did that entirely wrong. Uh, but, uh, as we watch El Marijuan... Uh, or T2, T2, crawling to death. Uh, so yeah, right next to him there, do I? Oh, all right, I thought I might spawn there. Um, so yeah, a couple of spawn bombs, basically. Spawn bombs are bombs that like people are gonna run into uh, like right as they spawn. You generally don't wanna do that, but um, outside either of those doors is probably gonna get somebody. Uh, they're really dirty, not cool bombs, but um, anyway, let's see if we get another one. Oh yeah, right here. That's probably a favorite spot. Um, there's a lot of people like to leave it like down there, but I don't know. In the horse trailer seems to work better. Um, when it's down against that wall, it seems to be kind of out of range, uh, of where people actually like squat. So, um, a lot of times you'll put it there and it won't even get anyone. Um, let's see. This militia seems to be in some business over there. Eh, no, she's soloing 1v4. Um, a lot of times when you late join a game, uh, and, and the team is just getting hosed like this. Uh, let's see, can I... Ah, he's not, he's covert. Let me see if I can down him. Move me. No, I'm gonna get shift here. Ah, oh, he was so hurt, too. Um, so yeah, uh, a lot of times when your team is, like, losing this bad, it's just because they're not playing together at all. Uh, and you can see that evidence right here, uh, you know, as I spawn in. This guy sprints dead away from me. Those two are far apart from each other. Um, anyway, back to bombs. Uh, so back in this window here. Uh, let's see. Um, uh, on that truck. We could kind of do it. Oh, here at the speedboat. This is a great spot. If you can get it to stay. Well, all right. I guess you can't get it to stay, but you can get it to stay sometimes. Um, and... That's a great little spot. Either way, that 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 might work. We'll see. Um, you can if somebody's over there, you can bank it over there. Oh. <laughs> uh, well, banking it on, on against that wall uh, will flush people out of that cover, and so you uh, throw it against that wall, and then you start aiming and and fire at them or throw a molly, as I was going to try to do, <laughs> but failed. Uh, so yeah, bombs, 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 bombs. Ooh. That's some first person gore. Um, so. Yeah, bombs. Um, back here, we've got probably my favorite bomb spot in the whole map. 
Um, seems like we are almost certainly about to lose this game, but never know. Let me see if I can plop that in there. Ish. Box does not think I'm losing this game as bad as I think I'm losing this game. Um, so yeah, right there is a pretty great spot. Um, people like to leave it in this little back room too, but I don't know. That, that spot there is pretty much more effective. You want to leave it against that wood pile and not against the wall. Um, uh, I don't know. It's just more effective there. Um, up here you can leave a, a couple of bombs right inside this window. is very effective. Um, uh, down there is pretty common. Uh, or just like in that corner on the stairs somewhere. Um, a lot of people leave a bomb here, although I'm not a big fan. It looks like it should be great. All right, I don't have one, but like, I don't know. Oh, well, something went off. Uh, so yeah, as they run by here, they can just run here and duck down behind this and that bomb won't affect them at all. So I'm not a big fan of that spot, but you see it, it's common. Um, let's see, bombs, bombs, bombs. Okay, so the speedbow bomb actually went off. Okay, the one that I didn't think I placed very well went off. Uh, yeah, so that one took, took a guy down. And they are also not playing with their team particularly well, so there might be space for a comeback here. Uh, you don't know. We're only down by, you know, nine guys. What is that? Three squad wipes? Not, not un impossible. <laughs> uh, so yeah, right there is that rookie bomb. Uh, they've already got one in here. I might, well, I might just save this. Uh, let's see. So I've got one coming along the right side, right there. I failed to mark him. Ooh. And there should be two from the left side, hard left. If I could get, I'm not really sure where I should be right now. Because my dude's up there coming, oh, yeah, that's another great bomb spot. People jump that wall right as they come out of the uh, spawn. Um, but my dude's up there, and I'm going to try and stay ground level just to provide decent support. We've got a guy on the right protecting that flank, so let's see. I think there's a guy here. Ah, it's around you again with his covert. He's just behind that Civic. Oh, come on. Oh! All right, well, that was just... I was being stupid. I shouldn't have been there. Um, ah, yeah, that was dumb. I, I got cocky. I thought my second potato would take him down, and I could rush at him. Uh, either way, I probably should have rushed them. Of course, Miss Malicious had a molly. She could have thrown that at him sooner. And that guy's got... That guy's got the shiv. Why are you wasting the smoke? Anyway. Uh, Miss Malicious has a chance for the comeback here. She's our 999, so I'm hoping that... Let's see, where are... Okay, they're over by the gazebo. And El Mar Marijuana. Oh, yeah, he's actually our tryhard. Miss Malicious is not quite a 999, but I'll give it to her. Uh, Ranjay is really the trouble. He's got the covert and a dozen downs to his name, so you know he knows what's up. Uh, yeah, in a case like this, your best bet is probably just to camp the lodge. Oh, there's somebody at the box there. Do they see him? No, they do not. Uh, all right, well, you probably, probably your best bet is just to camp the lodge. Once you get a wipe, rush the box uh, at the gazebo and hope that they don't get there before you do. Um, okay. Anyway, uh, let's see. All right. Well, they they took a couple of a uh, couple of down, a couple more downs while I wasn't paying attention. Let's see. El Marijuan, what do you got? He's covered too. It would appear. Otherwise, why is he crouch walking everywhere? Uh, he's got that hit stick. Got armor. This could be a chance. Got a burst pistol in hand. No large weapon. Doesn't look like he's got a perch. Oh, we got the smoke. Dude, shiv him! He's right there! What's he doing? Oh, he has the smoke. Oh, and he gets his friend mollied. Oh, no! <laughs> that went about as poorly as it could, M Mr. Marquan. Oh, no, well, now it's gone as poor as it could. <laughs> All right, well, so much for the comeback. I did know better than he, but anyway, I'll see you in the uh, private. We are back. Uh, we're doing bombs on Lakeside. Yeah, as I, I started to say in the previous uh, thing, uh, bombs doesn't seem like a natural fit for Lakeside, but there's actually like, because it's a long map, it's a sniping map, um, but that actually favors you because if somebody gets down by a bomb when they're on a flank, there's less chance of somebody getting to them. Um, 
if you have you know multiple people approaching, you, you have a lot of bomb bomb locations that are kind of I don't know. So like this was my favorite one there. Uh, you saw me place that during the game, so I won't again. But like in that corner, um, inside these windows, uh, a lot of people like to leave it like in that trash kind of trash can area. But then I think like as you come out, you kind of you don't you don't get kicked by that one mostly. Uh, so I don't know, maybe out a little ways. Uh, yeah, it's not a great bomb, but a lot of people like to leave it. Um, you can leave one inside here, either like in there or like um, like yeah, I guess in that corner. Uh, kind of on that line, or maybe like, yeah, on that line. So, a uh, couple options in there. Either one of those really works more or less the same. I guess the one closer inside would be best. Um, here you got a spot. I'd leave that kind of out towards the edge rather than in towards the wall. Uh, it's really just a one-way bomb. This is a pretty good spot. It's a really tricky placement. You kind of have to leave it like by that, um, kind of to the right where that foot is. You want to kind of leave it like where the handle of that trailer is. Um, and maybe I'll show you, uh, let's see, so like there, yeah, that's pretty much, that's eh, a little to the right, but uh, it's pretty much perfect, like an inch left of that is where I wanted it. <laughs> but, and the reason is because like you can't really see it. If you're coming up like this side, you can't really see it, and then as you saw, if you're coming up the other side, you can't really see it. So um, yeah, your, your footprints, by the way, um, only you can see your own footprints, so don't worry about them giving away your position or anything. The other people can't see their own, can't see your footprints, they can only see their own footprints. Um, I don't know if that'll change in the sequel or what, but anyway, so that bomb is there. Uh, let's see. You can leave one behind this van right there. It's not brilliant, but it works sometimes. It's a good opening opening bomb. Um, so people like to leave it in the shrubs there. Anytime you see these kind of like little tufts of grass and crap, leave one there. Um, that's kind of a tricky one because people like try to get up on that ladder. Like, see, I was trying to get up on that ladder and it just jumped me in. You have to actually, you yeah, know, that's if you want to jump it, you kind of go to the left side there, uh, like over on that furthest edge. Um, but if you want to climb it, kind of come in like at a middle approach there, not all the way, but like there. Um, yeah, this ladder is just tricky. You'll see half the time you'll just jump over the edge when you're trying to climb up it like that. Um, but yeah, anyway, because of that, this bomb makes a great bomb placement right there because people jump over it and then like they, they're confused because they wanted to go up the ladder anyway uh like there and there are the good spots inside here um i'd leave both if i were you for that one uh but you can always leave one or the other um let's see behind this in this chair or like behind this pillar or this uh whatever that is like a plant potter thing works um let's see on this stair this one's really tricky you want it to be behind this banister um basically like almost all the way you want the smoke to be let's see so yeah 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 that's pretty good um then it could be slightly better but uh yeah so you, you see the smoke is mostly obscured until it's too late uh and basically that's what you want um, you could maybe put that just slightly further in, but no, that's pretty good, actually. Uh, yeah, maybe just like there, I guess. Anyway, um, so let's see, yeah, right right there, or like in that chair is a very good spot. Pretty much any of these chairs, honestly. These ones aren't going to... I mean, if, if somebody runs past them, they'll kill them, but, uh, you know, he'd have to not be looking. And that could happen. He might be backing up, who knows, so it's a fun one. Um, right behind here, totally nobody ever expects that bomb. That's a really good spot. Um, and yeah, that's probably the best one or this one at the ladder, um, that I showed you earlier. Uh, so yeah, let's see, bombs from here. Um, yeah, there's that spot out the window. I don't love it, this spot here. Those are pretty critical. Um, the one right out the window, I feel like you can always run past, but... If you've got bomb expert or explosion expert on, that's always a you know modifier to, to how stupid of a bomb you can place and think you'll get away with it. Um, and let's see. Uh, okay, so we talked about the speedboat nose. Um, you can put one in the back of the speedboat. That's mostly just for lols, but you never know. You might catch somebody climbing up in there. Uh, <laughs> uh, and let's see if we get another bomb here. Yeah, so... Uh, you saw me bank it off that wall. Uh, you can also place one like in here. Uh, well, you, you can just place it right in there, basically. I won't leave it because it's just rolling a bomb. There's nothing hard about that place. Um, the, yeah, so that bush, this bush here. Um, and let's see. Uh, you, that's a great spot right there. That's basically 
uh, a rookie bomb. Um, but it can roll through this, like, it'll sort of roll through that stick, this stick here. Like, it, it, maybe I'll just, uh, well, anyway, I mean, it, it'll roll. You get it. Uh, so yeah, here on these two little vertices, uh, there or there. I like the one in the sunlight a little better. I think it disguises the smoke a little better, but either one pretty much just as effective. They're not, that's not a brilliant spot to leave a bomb. Maybe it's really best to leave it in the middle, because you can totally see it coming from here. Um, so maybe best to leave it there. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, this gazebo has like a weird roof thing, but I'm pretty sure you can't like throw in through it. Uh, I've tried before. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, it doesn't really will it go up. Nah. Um, but you can kind of roll it like there and like, and like have it bounce down and like explode in midair. Uh, let's see, can that get through? Nah, it seems like you can't really get in or out of those gaps there, which is disappointing. Um, but you can, yeah. Can you go in there? Maybe you could set one in there, like in the checkpoint sinks, I'm not sure. But um, anyway, uh, so yeah, common bombs down here would be like in this corner here, um, in this corner, like tucked in under that bench or like right here. Uh, and those are all spawn bombs, basically, uh, because people spawn over here, and then they're, like, walking out, and boom, uh, boom, boom. It's it's very annoying. People are, like, eating chips or having a soda or something, and you're blowing them all up. Uh, so it's rude, but it, it, those are effective. So if you don't mind being rude, that's an option for you. Um, let's see. Yeah, same out this window. Um, boom right there. Um Gosh, uh, let's see. Up here, if you just want to, uh, uh, if you want to prevent, okay, that did that about as worse as good. If you want to prevent a last stand, just like place a bomb right there. Um, it'll stop against that that stick right there. And so, uh, uh, yeah, uh, last stands almost always happen over here, and nobody expects a bomb to be there. So, if you expect a last stand, that's a great place to leave a bomb somewhere middle middle late through the game, um, or double even. Uh, Oh, come on. All right. Um, so, yeah, right there. Real. That's a rookie bomb. Probably one of the two, three good bombs. You'll see bombs right there. They didn't place it there. They placed it here and it rolled there. Um, it, this part right there, bombs roll right through. I don't have one right now, but I'll uh, see if I can grab one. That, that's probably kind of good to show. Uh, you can sort of put a bomb on that health kit right there. Uh, that's pretty cheeky. Uh, you know, it's not going to catch a really good player, but if it does, they'll laugh. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, you never know. Uh, those kind of like hide it inside of a health kit bombs almost, you know, they're all kind of for jokes for lols, but they're they're effective. Um, so let's see. You can always leave bombs in the middle of the street up against these cars. You never know when they'll work, uh, but it's kind of a waste. Um, inside this window is kind of a waste. Uh, people just jump right through and don't get killed. Um, this one's a good spot, though. Um, and of course in the bathroom is, uh, is a good spot, although I'd probably leave it like tucked in up against there. Uh, cause that, yeah, that'll totally catch people out if they go in there for sniping and be like, what the hell? <laughs> um, let's see, you've got inside the tiny room here, either, either side of this doorway, um, even like right up in that corner. I think it goes right through that. I'm not sure, uh, and the boxes are not being friendly. This glitched out piece of shrubbery here uh, is a good place to leave a bomb. Uh, but, you know, you just place it there. Um, and yeah, you saw me leave that one. Uh, yeah, yeah if, you're, if you're good, you can balance that right on there. If you're lucky, let's call it luck, not good. Uh, that's a good spot. This, I don't love this spot, but some people will put it there. Um, in here behind the sign is good if you have a lot of kind of snipers because people like to hang out here and fight against that so if you're if you're a sniper and you're trying to protect yourself or if you have a sniper and you want to protect him leave a bomb there um, this is a good one this is basically a spawn bomb I guess but um, it's really funny so whatever <laughs> uh, you basically leave it behind that wall they spawn they jump over that wall and they die um, it's, it is humorous. This is the real rookie bomb, the real classic, is just leaving it inside that little shrubbery. Uh, but if you want to get cheeky, you can come up here, crouch, and kind of roll it off the edge. Uh, okay, well, I didn't, that didn't quite go right. Um, it, like, if you roll it, you can get it, like, onto that fender, basically. Let's see. 
Mm, I don't know. It's a tricky... Oh, and now it rolled behind me. Great. It's a tricky placement, but it, it works and it's really funny. It ends up right there. Um, and let's see. Oh, what was that? Uh, oh, wow. I think I discovered a new glitch. Uh, yeah, anyway. Uh, well, so yeah. Uh, somewhere over there is a bomb spot. Hmm. I kind of covered this area already. Um, let's see. So yeah, any other bombs that are good around? Hmm. Uh, well, maybe I should just, uh, if you guys have any, oh, you know, if you're, if you're throwing a bomb into that truck, if you want to kind of skim that roof, um, if you sort of like clip it onto this roof, uh, it'll roll right in. Uh, well, maybe you want to hit it like halfway through that roof. Um, but it'll just roll right into that. I mean, obviously a molly would work. You just plop a molly straight into the back, but if you had a bomb, it's good to roll it off that roof. Or if you're coming from this side, just bounce it off those little edges like that. Um, and then, let's see. Uh, any other critical advice I can give you uh, about bombs? Um, yeah, so hmm, let's see if we get a bomb out of here. So you got the bomb there. Oh, you can leave a bomb kind of in that alley over there. That, that can be pretty useful, um, especially if people are on that house a lot, um, like up there sniping. You can also like use a bomb like defensively. Like if you're over here, and you want to, and somebody's fighting you on that house. You can kind of hop here, and you're in cover. Hop here, and you're in cover. And like, you should basically be in cover through this whole um, passage like that. If he's sniping from over there, this is all right. Well, that corner's not great cover, but this wall's okay. Yeah, that pops you up, so your head is visible, but this isn't. Um, so yeah, you like come to here, and then you can like either go inside the horse trailer, uh, or in any case, you like pop out and and toss a bomb, and you want to kind of hit the peak of the roof. Uh, I didn't quite see. Yeah, so you can see it like clips the peak of the roof, and then like float floats over just a little bit. And if you're on this side, all you see is this bomb go pink and then blow up. Uh, so it it can be kind of terrifying. Um, you can leave a bomb up on this horse trailer. That's just kind of for for lols as well. Um, uh, if you're up on that, uh, if you're up on this U-Haul uh, here uh, with the sight line towards that box um, or towards that, if you're fighting that house, let's say, then you can throw onto that peak. Well, okay, I think I, you know, I overthrew it a little bit, but you can throw onto that peak as well, um, and uh, that will uh, like trigger it early. Um, if you put it there, I mean, that would work if they're like, you know, it's going to roll to all the way there. So if they're like backing up, like that could be quite funny if, if they like see the bomb and they're just like, well, I'll run away. And then they blow up anyway. Um, but uh, let's see. So nothing really much back there worth putting a bomb down for. Um, you really want to kind of cover high traffic areas. So places you expect people to be. And like when I talk about rookie bombs, that means bombs that are like, common and expected um like in here you could put one although you can totally see that from this side so that's not very good uh but you can get creative with bombs like the bombs that that are well known like the ones that i talked about by the by the pickup by the horse trailer those are kind of like expected now and so if you really want to get people with bombs you got to place them in more interesting places uh and and come up with your own kind of signature moves um you can bounce bombs off of those walls like that uh off that window uh, also works, but off the wall works just as well. Um, here, uh, it's good to throw a... Let's see if we get one more bomb here. Uh, almost done with the tour. So, yeah, I'd like to thank you. If you have any if you have any bombs that I didn't mention, please throw them in the comments. Uh, I'm going to eventually do a grand tour of Lakeside and would love to mention your name with your bombs. Um, so, yeah, if you're at a window, you can bounce a bomb, like, off of there. Uh, and that gets in there. Uh, that's going to bounce like right behind that desk you can also just throw a molly of course but if they're not right at the window then that's not going to be that all that effective um easier to come at it from this angle i guess uh, and bounce off that but anyway that's uh that's been your bomb tour of lakeside i'm uh, gustav Mahler, and i'd like to thank you for coming by hope i'll see you next time that's it we're done here let command know we're coming home